Mizuki, let's go. Staying here would be a waste. Yeah. Where should we go next? Welcome! You're Mizuki, right? Ota's friend? Yep. And you... Oh, I suppose I should introduce myself more formally. At least something a little more than flashing your badge. My name is Konami Date. Mr. Date, what can I help you with? He went out early this morning. I don't know where. I see. Sorry to be a bother, but when Ota comes back, can you tell him to contact me? Oh, well, sure. Thanks, ma'am. Okay, got it. Date, let's go somewhere else. Yeah, let's go. Is this it? Yeah. You know about this place? Yeah. This is where I met Renshu for the first time. Interesting. Didn't think this was your kind of spot. This place is special. You can find all sorts of shady characters here. It's the best place for gathering information about a case. So that's why. That is only a partial truth. Shut up. Huh? Let's head inside. Where is everyone? It's been like this for a while. Not many people come here anymore. Mama should be here soon, though. Okay. news. At 6.10 p.m. yesterday, on the outer circle of the Capital City Highway in Minato District, Tokyo, a traffic collision occurred involving five cars and at least one truck. MPD has arrested the driver of the truck suspected to be the cause of the accident for negligence. The investigation is ongoing. No. And what do you mean by that? Nothing. Just let me know when you're tired. You can go home anytime you want. You aren't really worried about me. You just think I'm annoying, right? Don't beat around the bush. Just say it. But you know what? It wouldn't matter anyway because I'm not going home. Hey, Date. What did you and Daddy used to talk about when you were here? Hmm. <laughs> I don't remember a lot of it. I was usually drinking pretty hard. Don't worry. I have everything recorded. In fact, the conversation about you taking care of Mizuki took place here, at Marble. Really? The topic was brought up several times afterward, but the first time was here. Four years ago, after drinking enough liquid courage, Renju asked you to take care of Mizuki. At the time, Renju was recently divorced, buried in work at Lemniscute, and mentally unstable. 
It was a display of excellent judgment. It was a good thing that he managed to swallow his pride. You think so? Sometimes, I don't think it was the right move. You should have more confidence. I guarantee you that it was the best decision. Let's hope so. It's okay. Is it? Yup. Do you have a lot of friends? Yeah, but I don't really like my elementary school friends. They're too immature. I have more fun with Iris and Ota. I don't know if they're too immature. You're just very mature for your age. You think so? The kids at school are so stupid. They gossip about who had their first kiss for days. I don't see why that's anyone's business. These grade schoolers move fast. Nah, not really. It's pretty normal nowadays. You... You haven't kissed anyone yet, have you? No, I'm not interested in that. Oh, thank God. Did what? Sat at a table together like this. We haven't eaten dinner together in a while. After I finish working on this case, we should do it again. Why? Because of what happened to my mom and daddy? I don't need that. Date, this is where you need to take a stronger role as her guardian. Data suggests that children who eat alone are prone to mental imbalances and poor physical condition. The meals you prepare do have sufficient nutritional content. However, you need to make sure that Mizuki is eating all of it. Otherwise, your effort is wasted. I told you, I don't want to. Why not? Because... Um, I don't like how you hold chopsticks. It makes me sick. Really, no. People have always told me that I have good technique. Some even say it's beautiful. It's disgusting. Too clean. Besides, there's no point in eating together. Why is that? Because you don't talk when you're eating. I don't like sitting in silence. Well, we don't have to be quiet. It's fine, I don't like hearing you talk either. I believe she has entered her teenage rebellion phase a year early. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Date, honey! Long time no see. Hey, Mama, how have you been? Oh, tired and sore, but not in a fun way. <laughs> Watch the innuendo in front of the kid. Oh, who is this? Renju's daughter. Hi, nice to meet you. Oh, you're... I... Oh, it must have been hard. I saw on the news. It's okay. Really. Oh, it must have been so hard. Stupid Ren. What was he thinking, leaving his little girl like this? Oh... <laughs> hey, Mama. I wanted to ask you some questions about Renju. Oh. I guess crying isn't going to solve the thing, is it? Go ahead. Ask away. I'll help any way I can. bad. Hey, that's good. I want you to keep this place open as long as you can. It makes me feel sad and old when a place I used to visit closes down. Well, then you should visit more often. I could hook you up in more ways than one. Just the one way is fine, thanks. I haven't seen him for a while. I thought I was going to shrivel up and die of boredom without you boys around. Shrivel up? You look like a purple water balloon. <laughs> That's right. Care to give me a poke? I'll pass, thanks. Have you heard any rumors about Renju? Anything about grudges, disputes? Is it okay to talk in front of Mizuki? 
Yes, I want to be here. Trust me, you couldn't drag her away. If you say so. Apparently, Ren had some connections with the Kumakura gang. A gang? Yeah, real rough customers. This is their turf. So Daddy was involved with gangsters. Mizuki, that company Shoko was running, were they also tied to the Kumakuras? I don't know. Hmm. I heard that shady characters hang out here. So who are you and how do you fit in? No one special. I'm just a facilitator. A facilitator? People who come in here tend to have very specific interests. I help accommodate. Oh, okay. Mama's like uh, an informant. That's right. And I won't charge you this time. Just promise to get the bastards who did this to Ren for me. I promise. Not really. Oh, don't worry, honey. I don't bite. I'm only aggressive when it comes to men 20 through mm, 65. That's a pretty wide range. Gotta widen my net for a catch like you, Date, honey. <laughs> I think I'll ignore that one. I think I'll ignore it as well. Yeah, I mean, at some fish pocket they served alcohol, but I've never been to a bar like this. Well, I would hope not. You're in elementary school. Well, Daddy invited me along sometimes, but I was too shy to go. Good call. I was planning on going one day, when I was old enough to drink. I wanted to go to a bar with Daddy. Well, there was the watch incident. I'm sure you remember that one. Watch incident? You don't remember? Your drunk ass spilled your beer on Ren's watch. Ren was furious, yelling about how this watch is more important than my life, or whatever. He blew up on you. That was the only time I've ever seen Ren that mad. That's why I remember it so well. Ah, that's it. Why do you have it? Was it... At the scene? Ren was given that watch by his lover. It was an anniversary gift, I think. Lover? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot Mizuki was here. No, it's fine. But of course, it wasn't an affair. This was all after he was divorced. Daddy had a new lover. Yeah, this place is small. The bathrooms are outside. Take care. Iba, get boss on the line. Got it. Mizuki is at a bar called Marble down in Golden Yokocho. Send someone over to pick her up. She's not at the hospital? Uh, yeah, she snuck out. I took her along while I was doing some work, but I can't take her any further. Understood. I'll send someone. Counting on you, boss. Are you going to leave Mizuki here? Yes. I can't take her into a Yakuza den.
Who's this asshole? You made a big mistake coming here. Go home. All right. Bye then. Hey, Date. What? Ugh, I hate dealing with these chumps. Didn't you hear me? Do you want to die, old man? You bastard! Sorry for the late introduction. I'm with the MPD. A cop, huh? So, you want to explain what the fuck a cop is doing in my office? I think we should exchange names before exchanging expletives. Name's MoMA, the war horse. I don't give a fuck what your name is. All right, MoMA. I have a few things I want to ask you. What do you know about the new Cyclops serial killings? Saw it on the news. But we had nothing to do with it. Even if we did, we wouldn't spill to no cops. Don't know nothing about her. I know her face and her name. It was on the news. Nothing else. Shoko was part of an investment fraud scheme. And I have it on good authority that a certain Yakuza gang was helping her. Wouldn't know nothing about that, cop. I told you, I got nothing to say. You deaf or something? <laughs> what? Chairman is right in front of you. What? I run the Kumakura gang. I'm Moma Kumakura. That can't be right. The chairman of the Kumakuras is Rohan. You aren't the chairman. Yo, asshole! You need a lesson in manners? Date, wait. I did some research and discovered that Rohan Kumakura died last year. He leapt to his death from the roof of a building. Suicide. But MoMA did not take over last year. MoMA took over six years ago. Six years ago. Date, a minute please. What is it? Do you see the sofa in the reception area? There is an ashtray on top of the coffee table. What about it? It is peculiar. Thermal imaging reveals that they are both warm. The sofa and ashtray? Turn off the thermal vision. Sure. I see. The cigarette brand is Klein. Why is that relevant? Small details will come in useful later. Trust me. Hmm. I got nothing to say to you. Dragon. A bronze dragon holding a golden ball. Golden ball, huh? What does a guy like the chairman need this for? He probably just uses it for porn. Not every man in the world is like you, Date. It's kind of frightening seeing all these lanterns lined up. Scary lanterns. Scary. Lanterns. You 
don't have to repeat it. the first guest today although you are an uninvited guest don't lie now someone was sitting on the sofa and smoking very recently how do you know that i just do all right i remember now just a bit ago one of our guys was on the sofa are you talking about these guys right here yeah not possible when I came in. You made a big mistake coming here. Go home. Who's this asshole? Neither of them was on the sofa. And neither of them was smoking. They left. Who left? Uh, an insurance salesman. Right before you came in. I don't think so. I didn't pass by anyone on my way here. And I happen to know this office only has one entrance and one exit. Which means, whoever it is, they're still in this office somewhere. Let me check the back. Why you want to do that? I just wanted to say hello to our guest. I'm telling you, you're the only one here. Oh, then you won't mind me checking. Just get out of here, cop. There must be someone they don't want us to see. Somewhere behind that wall. Just as I thought. This must be whoever was sitting on the sofa and smoking earlier. My evolver can shoot right through this wall. Wait! Hmm, is he not getting enough? What? Never mind. The person behind the wall is unarmed. I cannot approve the use of a revolver in this situation. Damn it. at your feet. What? Hey! Did you just shoot at me?
revolver with explosive rounds. Aim for the dragon's gold ball on the right. The what? Oh, that. Why? Just do it! Too old to be playing with toys? Shit! Hey, coward! I see you! Show your face! this guy doing here? I've had a relationship with the Kumakura since back when Rohan was running things. I had business nearby, so I stopped here for a visit. Whatever conspiracy theory you're imagining in your head, you can forget it. This is strictly business. Strictly business? A congressman meeting with Yakuza? How are you going to spin that? It's true. I imagine my public image will be dragged through the mud. But we haven't done anything illegal. If you want to accuse me of such wrongdoing, then by all means. I just happen to think such gossip is better suited for tabloids. I went to work, then went home. So, you have no alibi? No, I always have my bodyguards near me. If you want to, you can ask them. Bodyguard testimony can be unreliable. There is a possibility that they would lie to protect Mr. Sejima. I agree. We can't trust that. The president of Lemniscate? We aren't friends, but I did meet him a few times through work. What work were you doing to meet up with the head of an entertainment company? It was just some party hosted by some company or other. It's not unusual. Events with those uptight stuffed shirts can be rather dull. So they have some young women from an entertainment office attend. Anyway, we only saw each other a few times. I don't even remember what we spoke about. I heard that the former head of the Kumakuras committed suicide last year. Yeah, what's it to you? Nothing at all. I just want to talk about it. Rohan was my older brother. He was my big brother in this organization, and my blood brother. Six years ago, he, uh... He got sick in the head. He got sent to a special hospital. 
And naturally, because I'm his brother and next in line, I was the successor. That's all I'm gonna say. You wanna know more? Hire a private eye. Us Kumakuras are a branch of the Ujisaki family. The Ujisaki family runs a yearly golf tournament. Mandatory attendance. We were all at the tournament those days. We only got back this morning. You've been asked a hotel. They'll tell you. Date, I did some research. The hotel's record of guests does list the Kumakura members. They were also seen on several surveillance cameras. It is not possible that any of the Kumakuras could have killed Shoko, including Moma. <sighs> well, I guess there's no point hiding it now. I lied earlier, when I said I didn't know her. I thought so. You and the Kumakuras were a part of the fraud scheme Shoko was organizing. Yep. Whenever any wise-ass investors gave her trouble, we handled it. Exactly as I suspected. Shoko was affiliated with the Kumakuras. I've been looking after that guy since high school. It was the usual stuff. I had him help me with a lot of work. But now, it's kind of the opposite, you know? We're getting work from him. Well, we were. Now that he's dead, though. What work did he have you do? Eh, the usual. If Talon at his office was causing trouble or something... You ever get into any disputes with Renju doing this work? No way, he paid good money. I'd never even gotten into an argument with the guy. The victim prior to Renju? I believe Moma introduced me to her. Introduced? We were just having drinks. Shoko stopped by to say hello. Right. We didn't talk about anything. They're trying to give me the runaround. Indeed. Date, I have determined that these individuals have nothing further to add. Even if they are involved, they will not volunteer any more information. We need solid evidence to move forward with the investigation. You're right. Date, a call from Lemnisate. Connected. Date? It's me! Um, you remember, like, how he said to call you if I was a game? Well, he's here now, so I guess I'm calling you. Got it. I'm on my way. Where are you going? It's none of your concern. MoMA, Congressman Sejima, I think I'm gonna call it a day. I'll come back soon. We'll swap drinking stories. You serious? Hmm. Let's go, Iva. Roger.